It's not shrimp creole, but it is Cajun fish creole. I'm Tess, and I'm going to make a delicious and rich Cajun fish creole using haddock. Stay tuned. This Cajun fish creole recipe is easy, all made in one pot, healthy, and of course delicious. In a pan on medium heat, I'm adding a little olive oil and the Cajun Holy Trinity, which is a vegetable combination of diced onions, celery, and bell peppers, seasoning with a little salt and black pepper. For a little heat, I'm adding a half of a minced seeded jalapeno pepper, giving everything a good toss and cooking for about five minutes or until the veggies are soft. Next goes in a good dose of minced garlic some chopped anchovies with a little of the anchovy oil, and some tomato paste. I also have some chopped green onions. I'm adding the whites now and I'll be adding the greens later, stirring and cooking for another minute. This smells so good. And by the way, you can find this recipe in the list of ingredients in the description box below. To add some additional flavor, I'm adding a can of chopped minced clams with the juice. In goes one can of diced tomatoes and giving everything a stir. I'm adding just a little sugar to balance out the acidity of the tomatoes. Adding some Worcestershire sauce and Cajun seasoning. You can use your favorite Cajun seasoning. Bringing up to a simmer and cooking for 15 minutes. I have some heat with the jalapeno pepper and there was a little cayenne kick in the Cajun seasoning. If you like more heat, you can add some red pepper flakes. It's been 15 minutes and you can see the liquid has reduced some. I'm adding in a handful of fresh chopped parsley, the green onions, and the haddock. I kept the fish in nice sized pieces. It will only take about 10 to 15 minutes for the fish to fully cook. Cod is another good fish to use for this Cajun Creole recipe, but you can use any white fish or really any seafood that you like. Giving everything a good toss and letting it simmer until the haddock is fully cooked and flaky. Serving tonight with some rice. This is such an easy one-pot Cajun dish. The background anchovies and the clams really add a depth of flavor to this dish. You can taste all the spices that blend so well together. If you're in the mood for something Cajun, this Cajun fish creole might be something for you. I hope you give this fish creole recipe a try. If you like this Cajun fish creole recipe, please remember to hit the like button and leave a comment below. I always love to hear from my viewers. Remember to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell to receive my future video recipes. You can also find me and more of what I'm cooking at my website and on Facebook. And until next time, enjoy. <music>